Well, we had originally planned to be here uh, as representatives of our uh, court uh, with our crowns on. And we were told that we were not going to be allowed to wear the crowns, even though they are the uh, symbols of our constituents. Uh, we represent uh, the, the Court of Surrey, uh, the Empire of the Peace Arts Monarchist Association, uh, and it includes uh, Burnaby through to Mission on the North Shore of, of the Fraser River, and from Richmond to Chilliwack along the south side. Uh, we are headquartered in Surrey, and we represent somewhere over uh, 800,000 constituents, and the crowns are our symbol. What was the reason given uh, that you weren't allowed to wear those crowns? Uh, was there a reason? It's the precedence of, the, I guess, Queen Elizabeth wears her crown here, and generally they don't allow you to wear tiaras or sashes if you're a pageant queen or others. So the ruling was made that we would not be accepted into the house if we wore those symbols. Who made that ruling? Um, Spencer Herbert was asking, the MLA was asking, the Speaker of the House if there could be um, a variance for that rule as the Empress of Edmonton had been presented in the Alberta Legislature wearing her crown. And unfortunately we were informed earlier this week that we would not be able to. We chose to come here today to bring our crowns with us in a final attempt to try and wear them within the House when we're acknowledged but we were unsuccessful to do so and we chose it was to uh, obey the rules as they are written now to be here for the honor of being announced for the charity work we do and the people we represent. What do you think of that decision by the speaker? It's disappointing. It's a little archaic. Yeah. We have protocol manuals within our court and we understand the place of protocol. Um, it gives you comfort when you know what is going to occur, but it also causes a little bit of rigidity and resistance to change. When we were elected at our coronation by the people that we represent, they held the crowns over our heads and our oath states, do you accept this symbol of the office that you have been elected to? And we have to respond to that. I said yes. The and I said yes. Said yes. And the crowns were placed upon our head. And representing we, those people. When we travel and we're introduced as the Emperor and Empress of Surrey, we always wear the state crowns. It is the very symbol of the commitment we have to represent the community with honor and grace. So it is that grace that made us here today to obey the rules as they were explained to us and we'll see what can happen in the future.